While restaurants here in San Diego are allowed to stay open for now, tonight is the first night that bars, wineries, and breweries that don't serve food are shut down for the foreseeable future. Our Misha Devono is live for us in Solana Beach with that part of the story. Misha. Yeah, Andrew, good evening. We're along the 101 in Solana Beach. This is really the hub for bars and restaurants here in North County. Many of these bars just reopened, barely surviving, and you know, really looking forward to the 4th of July weekend to kind of make up some of that revenue and time. And now we know that most of them will not. Bars and restaurants are moving outdoors to try and make up for lost revenue from social distancing orders as the county once again closes bars, wineries and breweries and hits restaurants with a 10 p.m. curfew. 70% of our revenue is usually after 10 at night and so it's going to be a tremendous burden for us just to be able to survive. After being closed for three months, a saddle bar, a popular late night watering hole along the 101 in Solana Beach, is one of the lucky ones, sharing a kitchen with a restaurant next door to stay afloat. It's horrible. It's unfortunate, you know, it just we live in a community that's had 21 documented cases of coronavirus and um, that's it. And it's 21 too many, but like a lot of other business owners impacted by the latest health order, he says he's angry because while they're only doing about 30% of what they normally do, they're doing everything right to keep people safe. For the county just to come in and just, you know, set this mandate countywide without going jurisdiction by jurisdiction or case by case just seems tremendously unfair to us uh, since there's not a problem here and we're doing all the right things. Under the new restrictions, a patron who orders alcohol must also order food and consume it sitting down. Doors close at 10, remaining customers out by 11. We were just barely recovering from last time and now to go through it again is just, we think, just it's going to be daunting and really unfair. Up and down the coast, it's the same. Eateries building out to allow for more business. The Saddles taking these parking spots in hopes to be ready for the 4th of July. Hopefully we get a little bit of our summer back. We're hoping it'll be a little a boost in something exciting, you know, in, in some of these dark times. And you can see already this restaurant here, the Pillbox, they've already built out in front of their establishment tables for people to enjoy. This uh, new order is in effect until August 1st. No doubt we're going to be see more of restaurants moving out into the streets, just doing what they can to make up for lost revenue and try and survive. From Solana Beach, Misha DeBono, Fox 5 News.